This has been the most challenging year of my life. We walked through 2023 and life presented us with an expansive array of challenges. Experiences that were gutting and life altering. We faced endless health scares filled with more hospital stays and ER visits than one may experience in a lifetime. Our lives were an endless flow through the heart-wrenching pain one faces on a journey with cancer. Continuously weaving through the enormity of healing cancer alongside mold illness. 2023 took us to the deepest depth of ourselves we've known, asked us to look at our grief and then walk alongside it. Through choosing to face the pain, grief, and fear and let it walk alongside us, something magnificent happened. The lens in which I see the world changed. Suddenly, my knowing was fortified. The ability to accept, listen, and trust that inner self became my North Star. My depth of love grew more vast and deep by choosing to stand, love, and be present even as the waves crashed down. Knowing that choosing to stand in that love means the depth of my pain, if there is a loss, will be even greater in still choosing to stand. The optimism that was once a facade has become more of the default. Finding the light even in the darkest of moments, even if it's just a sliver. I learned to feel the big emotions, letting them move and know that I can still stand with light in my eyes and love in my heart. My depth to hold, learn, and evolve as the currents of life change has vastly expanded. With these new, clearer, more loving lenses I see through today, I entered 2024 feeling more gentle, loving, and lighter despite the rocky waters that weave through our life. The new year is a time when we are bombarded with the idea that we need to overhaul our lives become the best version of ourselves, and be the most productive. To that, I say, no thank you. I see that storyline as a way to try and clear away the parts of us that we don't love. The parts of ourselves that are not glamorous and that we feel ashamed of. It's a story I've bought into many times over, yet it never seems to serve me. Those parts are always still there, no matter how hard I try to cover them up or replace them with more polished parts. 2023 showed me that you don't have to hide those scary parts. Instead, letting them walk with you lightens the burden. They made you who you are today and will continue to shape you into all the many different versions of yourself come. In this new year, I'm choosing to walk with all the pieces that have made me who I am. I'm choosing to radically slow down, to take the time to see, enjoy, and be fully immersed in the mundane. The sweet moments of laughter, witnessing a sunrise, seeing the way Kyle looks at me, and the way my heart soars when I take the time to witness all the beauty around me. The tenderness of heartache from the challenges we will face, the frustration when I inevitably mess something up, and the disappointment when I say or do the thing that hurts me or someone I love. In truth, it's an invitation to myself to be fully me. Leaning into myself, my softness, my hardness, and all the pieces and parts of me and accepting them. Letting them walk this journey of life with me just as I've chosen this past year to let grief walk along with me. It's in this invitation to fully embrace myself I'm called to return to documenting our life. Capturing the moments that I could not 
day or two over the last four months. When I'm here and these moments, I feel most alive. I soften, I'm guided by the beauty of the world and everything feels divine. It's as if the world turned into technicolor, seeing everything around me as truly magnificent. In choosing to capture the moments of every day, I am more present and less drawn to numbing. At the same time, it's where I feel most vulnerable and most exposed. I am me standing here being seen, something I wasn't able to do over the last many months. I was so raw from the thrashing of life that to deeply stand in myself to be seen felt so daunting and scary. Yet here I am, returning to being here, exposed in the fullness of myself, loving being right here, guided by the beauty once again. Letting my knowing be the guide on this journey into another year of life. Leaning deeper into myself and the boundless love that envelops us by simply being humans, walking through life with our hearts wide open. I am here fully ready to experience all the magic that's right in front of us. I am prepared to embrace the pain just as much as the divine and know they both serve a deep, deep purpose.